In this video, we're going to look at how to expand single brackets, like in these two questions here, where we have one term on the outside of the brackets and two or more terms on the inside. If we start with this first question on the left, what this expression really means is that we have three sets of the 2x plus 3y. So to work this out, one way of doing it would be to just add together three sets of the 2x plus 3y. So 2x plus 3y plus 2x plus 3y plus another 2x plus 3y. And then by collecting together all the like terms, we'd see that we have a total of six x's and nine y's. So our final answer would be 6x plus 9y. Now, everything we've just done here is perfectly correct, but this isn't the way that we'd normally solve this sort of question, because there's also a much quicker way we can use. This is where we multiply the term in front, so the 3, by each of the terms inside the bracket. So we'd do 3 times 2x, which is 6x, plus 3 times 3y, which is 9y. So again, we get the same answer of 6x plus 9y. But this technique was just a little bit quicker. For this next one, because the 5a is the term on the outside of the brackets this time, we need to multiply the 5a by all three of these terms inside the bracket. And I recommend you using these little arrows like this to indicate which ones you need to multiply. So you'd have to do 5a times 4a, which is 20a squared. Then 5a times minus 3b, which is minus 15ab. And finally, 5a times 6, which is 30a. So in total, you'd have 20a squared minus 15ab plus 30a as your overall answer. Let's have a go at one more before we finish. The important thing in this one is that the bracket is only being multiplied by this 3. This 2x term on the left is completely separate for now. So the first thing you need to do here is multiply the 3 by the x and the minus 5, giving you 3x minus 15. And then once you've done that, and we've expanded that bracket, we can bring down the 2x term as well. So you're now left with 2x plus 3x minus 15, which you can then simplify to 5x minus 15 as your final answer. Anyway, that's everything for this video. So hope you found it useful, and thanks for watching.